Karen Ann Davenport and her daughter Shannon are suing Kelly Filkins for scamming them on eBay. The plaintiffs claim they paid Kelly for two cell phones and in return she sent them two pictures of cell phones. All rise. Mrs. Davenport, what did you purchase at this auction? We purchased two i580 cell phones. For how much? One was 201.50 and one was 255.56. You sent her money? Correct. And what did you get in return? I got the envelope and I got um, these two sheets of paper. And her husband told me that uh, I paid for what I got. Thank you for the shopping spree. I asked him for my money back and he said, no, I've already spent the money on merchandise I wanted to get. And he laughed and told me to take him to court. So I hung up the phone and I have not talked to them since. Where's your husband? He's at home with our children. He couldn't come. Why couldn't he come? Because we couldn't find a babysitter. So he had to Why stay didn't home. you stay home? Because I would rather come than him. The eBay auction is in my name. Oh, good. So you are responsible for this? Yes. Explain it. Uh, it states very clearly in the auction that this is for a photo only. I sent her Listen to me carefully. Listen to me carefully. I want you to listen. Listen to me carefully. She sent you four hundred and four sixty seven seventy four hundred and sixty seven dollars. And you sent her two photographs of the cell phones. And you say that that's what she paid for. Two photographs of the cell phones. Are we understanding each other? Yes. You're an idiot. And a scammer. And if you came here to defend that position, to me, you're going to be unsuccessful because you are a thief. You yeah, are nothing a thief. to do with the auction. Listen to me. You're a thief because your husband said to her, thank you for the shopping spree. My husband spree. never said that to her. Absolutely did. No, he didn't. Absolutely not. did. Because I believe that if you are married to this man, and the two of you are not only unfortunately married to each other, two scammers, but created children together, that's unfortunate for the children, you're a thief. Outrageous. You are outrageous, madam. Why don't you get a job? Look at me. You're an outrageous person. And your husband is an outrageous person. What I don't understand is somebody with the unenviable position of being in your position right there today, why you would risk humiliating yourself in front of 10 million people is something that is totally beyond me. You are an outrageous person. Now I want to know what she posted on the website after you harassed her for your money back. I never said... Don't speak until I speak to you. She got what she paid Don't for. Don't speak until I speak to you. How many children do you have, Ms. Wilkins? Three. How old are they? Five, three, and two. You have an active case with Child Protective Services? No. You might. For what? I didn't harm my children. I didn't put my children oh, in any danger. Something. Let me tell you something. Bringing this kind of activity into your home. What I'm kind risking, of activity? I'm she can't read. It's listen. not my fault she can't read. No, listen to me, madam. I read your ad. Uh -huh. Listen to me. I, shh, listen to me. I'm older, smarter. If you live to be 120, you're not going to be as smart as I am in one finger. 4.90 ounces. This does not weigh 4.90 ounces. That's what you sent to her. When I said to you that if you live until you're 150, you're not going to be as smart as I am in one finger, I want you to trust me on this because I, being in your position, would never humiliate myself in front of 10 million people. Never! Well, there was eight other people at this auction she scammed. She doesn't like to work. She likes to make babies. She likes to make babies. She thinks that that's... There other people She thinks that, that you have to be smart to make babies. Don't speak to me until I speak to you. Don't speak to me. Until I speak to you, you have to find something else to do with your time constructively other than make children who are going to grow up with no moral compass like their mother. Judgment for the plaintiff in the amount of $5,000. That's all. Thank you. Said this is for a photo only. What is so hard to understand about that?